truth is, how you doing? Uh, yeah, I got my shades on. I think it's it's probably going to wind up being my uh, trademark look until uh, YouTube stops messing with my thumbnails. Like, I swear to God, I'll try to stare at the camera the whole time, and 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 they'll find the only three frames in the whole track where I'm looking off this way and my eyes are closed or something. You know what I mean? So, whatever. Uh, <laughs> You know, I just want to call you guys' attention, uh, my subs, over to uh, the Flat Earth Hub. Uh, if you're not already subscribed, definitely go over and subscribe. Those guys are serious about it. Uh, I like what they're doing. They, they got a couple guys who literally, literally hitch, hitchhiking across Canada, hitching for truth. <laughs> you know, uh, they're out there trying to do things hands-on, you know definitely one of the most uh forward moving channels there is out there so sub to the hub you guys flat earth hub <coughs> i don't really have too much to say today i guess more of the same um this pokemon go thing i mean geez if you can't see that it's almost like uh remember 1984 remember how the kids were turning the parents in you know oh thought criminal thought criminal and the guy's like, what are you in for? He's like, ah, oh, my little daughter turned me in. No, I, I was talking out against the party in my sleep. Hey, as crazy as that sounds, it's really not that, that well, we're not that far off. As a matter of fact, we're right there. This is 1984. We are in 1984. It's just a little, it's more concealed. It's more the soft hand. It's not so much the heavy hand as it was in the book. But this Pokemon Go thing, I mean, it's, it's it's real simple. It's just another way to get, uh, they can they can activate your camera on your phone and shit. So you figure if your kids are hooked up to that, um, it's just more surveillance. It's, it's real easy. It's just more categorization, more surveillance, more diversion, more division. We need to be anti-division. Everybody is divided up now. It's always, what side are you going to pick? What side are you going to pick? How about uh, the humanitarian side? How about the right side? You know, there, there's, there is a right and wrong thing to do. It's not, it's not based on, uh, you know, <laughs> where you come from or your opinion or, you know, there is a, a right way and a wrong way to do things. Sometimes there's a couple of different right ways. Lots of different wrong ways, always, always. So I've said it before and I'm going to continue to say it. YouTube and just the whole online thing is a small part of what I actually do with this. You gotta think, uh, how many people, how many people are flat earthers that, that don't have a channel to go over and subscribe, right? They just look. There's lots, there's lots. You know, I don't believe anything about the numbers, the, any of the statistics that YouTube would give me because I know that they're all part of the, part of the deception, like just whatever the, uh, the numbers are designed to make you think a certain way. There would be nothing true about the numbers ever. Like. But, uh, yeah, like I said, YouTube, online, uh, it's just a small tip of the iceberg. Also, you know, I, I'm thinking about looking for some, for some other mediums, another, something similar to YouTube, and just to start opening up channels. You know what I mean? Why not? Let's reach, reach some other people. But, uh, I can't stress enough, you know, to, to, to get on your feet, get a couple of beers in you or whatever it takes for you to, 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 to not be self-conscious or shy about talking to strangers. So we'll and meet you back at home. Just oh, do it. Well, just go for it. All right, so I mean, we'll meet just, you back at home. I, don't, I find myself sometimes on the street corner like a freaking street preacher with four or five, six people gathered around me. <laughs> it just happens that way. So, you know... Uh, and I'll say again, you know, there's, just, there's, there's plenty of little ways to just make a bunch of flat earth stickers and stick them everywhere. Keep dropping hints, man. Just gotta keep putting those two words together, flat earth, and then pushing it forward. Very simple. It's so easy, it's complicated, you know what I mean? Like, and uh, it really is easy to see that there's two, there is two camps to this truth movement. There's, there's the side that is obviously benefiting from it, and if they had their way, the confusion would continue. It would be more, and it would just, it would just stay that way. I mean, why not? They're benefiting from it. 
And then there's people like us who have nothing to really lose and nothing to really gain, you know, at least financially or whatever. We're not, we're not making money doing this. You know? I'm not making money right now. I don't care. Anything you do that, that you really put your, put your heart and your mind into is not for financial gain or at least not solely for financial gain. You know, I play music. You know, when I was a kid, I wanted to be a rock star, you know what I mean? Uh, but I didn't play music because I wanted to make millions of dollars. That's not why I played. I played because I love to do it, you know? And we, we love it. That's why we do it. You know? And uh, this whole, like, this whole truth exposure thing that we're into uh, does the same thing. It's a, it's, it, it, it satisfies a certain part of us that, you know... Because there's nothing worse than feeling like it's, you're in a fucked up situation and there's nothing that you can do about it. That's not true at all. There's lots that can be done about it. The main thing, even without even doing anything about it, it's more just knowing about it. Knowing about it, you're already armed with way more, um, you know, ability to deal with and recognize certain things. You know, like, I get in arguments with people where they're like, yeah, but you get all, you know, you get your information from a screen, too. And it's like, right, right, I do. And also, a lot of the information I get from that screen is highly inaccurate. And I know that. But if you take it all in, some of what you have up here in the fucking grape is the truth. You just got to pick it apart. And, you know, it, it gets easier, though. It gets easier to spot what, you know, generally, the truth never has an ulterior motive. You know what I mean? It's just the truth is what it is. And, like, it, it really can't be hidden. It can be hidden for a while, but, like, truth will always surface. I mean, I think we all know that. I think, I think we all know, or we can all at least somewhat agree that there is some sort of a force out there, like karma, where, like, what you put out does come back. It, it just, it's like, it's like a law. You know, it's like a, it's like a physical law. <laughs> um, and I know it doesn't seem like sometimes like people get what they should have coming back to them. They just keep putting it out and then they don't seem to get it back, but they do, they do, they do. It, it, it all comes back one way or the other. You know, even just lies, just that negative energy coming out of you. You know, uh, how many times have we lied about something and just, uh, just like biggest mistake you could make because it comes right back and just, then you either have to tell more lies. Either way, it's biting you. It's biting you. You know, you have to tell a lie, and then you never hear about it again. That very rarely happens. Almost always, you tell that lie, you'll have to tell the same lie more than once, and that's where your problem starts. Because <laughs> then you got to remember what you said and all that. I've just I've found that life without lies. You know, I was never a big liar. Never. Not like I haven't done it, but you know, you know how it is. Some people, it just seems like they just lie about whatever, like they just have to almost. Like things you don't even need to lie about. You know, like, something to be said about that, you know. Like, but I don't know really where I was going with this video, but I'm happy to be free, I'm happy to be breathing, able bodied. And I'm just so happy that within my lifetime, I've, I've I got a small little grain of truth that I can hold on to that I, you know, it helps. It definitely helps. It really helps when you start doubting yourself or whatever. You just remember. It. It's like, oh yeah, that's right. Things, things are fucked up, man. It's not, it, it's a rigged game, you know? So any little bit of knowledge you can get that's going to help you to stay on your feet in this game because once you fall you're done once you fall the herd will fucking run you over you know what I mean people won't piss on you if you're on fire <laughs> anyways peace to all I plan on doing a live hangout soon it's, uh, it's Tuesday I don't know maybe maybe Thursday Maybe I'll just turn it on. Yeah. Like Whatever comes on, comes on. Yeah, that was good. good. Oh, I want that's supposed to be. I want to see what the man. Okay.